Postal Jones, TV Yorkshire, with Josh Warrington, the main man of Leeds. How are you doing? This is, this is the main man, Ryan. Main man of Yorkshire, main man of the country. <laughs> I'm very well, thank you, Paul. Um, good to see you as always. Good to see you. Um, I just had the final press conference. Uh, just ready to go for Saturday now. Yeah. Um, so really, you know, with with all the fans, what you're not you're not shy of being in, in in a situation like this. Constantly, every fight you have, you're well supported. What do you think the pressure is on you today? Um, I don't think there's much pressure today. I much pressure on Saturday night in the fight. Um, I've got to get through it if I want to go on and fight for the world title. Um, obviously, being unbeaten as well, you've got the pressure, you want to keep that unbeaten record. And every time we come into Leeds, um, people expect me to win. You know, this isn't an easy fight whatsoever. It's, it's probably my toughest fight yet. Patrick, big puncher, tough guy. He's been around forever. You know, I think mm. he made his pro debut in 2006. So, um, you know, it's going to be a tough fight, like I say. Um, but I've trained hard for it. And as always, I give 100% in the ring on Saturday night. But um, like, like we know, um, you, you're always well supported. You're the number one for the WBC. It's hard not to look ahead. But does Josh Warrington need to ever come out of Leeds with the support you have? Um, not really. I, mean, I could fight here forever, but you know, we don't mind travelling. As fans, don't mind travelling either. If, uh, if we had to go away, no matter where, um, the fans would travel. I mean, I had a, an eight-rounder last year in Berlin and we took 700 over and that was just a tick-over fight. So uh, the fans will go wherever. I'm very grateful for the support and they're very loyal. Um, I think they just want to see me win a world title now and uh, we're so close to doing so. I've got to keep that momentum going and I've got to keep winning. Like we were saying earlier on, your number one by the WBC. Does Josh Wellington need to fight at least over? No, not all. You know, I think that's just because it's been built up by media over the last... And now it's started to get a bit nasty between us. Uh, things have started getting a bit personal. Um, but, you know, that's got to a stage where I want to fight him because of the dislike I have for him now. But, um, you know, I respect him as a champion, but as a person and the way he's gone about things, you know, very disrespectful. Um, but he's not the only option, you know. He's got to mm. remember that we, our fan base can bring world champions over here. Uh, if we were to fight at Ellen Road, we could fight any world champion at Ellen Road. You know, the, the division's wide open. You know, you've got Santa Cruz and Frampton going at it um, on the same night as us. You know, there's a possibility of fighting one of them. I'm the ranked number one, like you say, with WBC. You know, talks of Gary Russell Jr. moving up, or if you don't, that'd be a good fight. And uh, Oscar Valdez has just won WBO. I reckon he'll be wanting to defend that sometime soon. Even though I'm not ranked as high with WBO, he'll have mandatories and he'll have voluntaries. So, mm. you know, there's fight, other fights there as well. So in an ideal world, Saturday comes and you're victorious. You go on to win a world title. Then you can look at unifications with who you've just mentioned. <laughs> yeah, baby steps. Baby yeah. steps. I think, Paul. I think the yeah. first thing first is uh, get this one out way, fully focused on Saturday. And if we get through this one, then uh, I'll have a couple of weeks off because I've been more or less non-stop it since I've been at Amagasi fight. And then after that, um, you know, start negotiating for fighting for the world title. You know, last three fights have been you know fringe world level. You know, just underneath. And I think um, we need to take that step up and have that big challenge.